Members of the CIH are, are the lifeblood of this organisation. Uh, they provide us with the critical mass that we need to actually influence government, influence the policies uh, of this country and ultimately protect the lives of the people that we protect. It is our members who actually provide the services uh, and the support to public health improvement uh, that is so valuable in this country. Without our members there's no purpose to what we do. Um, without them um, we would be rudderless and directionless. Our, the whole point of the membership is they direct us through what they want to see um, influence their practice and their experience be it in education or postgraduate professional development. Well members are at the heart of everything we do and being a CIH member means you are informed, involved and connected no matter what um, professional employment sector you work in or what specialist field you're involved in. If you're, if you're not a member I, I think you, you potentially will become insular, you, you won't know what actually is going on in the profession and there's a danger that you can start do things, you know, you're going to do things wrong or you're going to be missing out on the latest guidance etc. So by keeping in the institution you're definitely keeping up to date and also you're doing all that networking and finding out what your peers are doing. Um, I think whilst I was working in local authority, which I did for 10 years, there was a lot of support, there was a lot of training going on um, and now since moving into private practice that has continued um, and has given me a different aspect on the work that I do, has given me different support commercially as well as um, in my kind of career. They provide me with great support, they advocate uh, for our profession at a higher level which is really, really important, they provide tr wonderful training courses. I've had an opportunity, whilst being a member of the Chartered Institute of Environmental Health, to develop as a practicing environmental health officer to network with other members, not just within the local authority setting, but also private. So I've really enjoyed being a member of the Chartered Institute of Environmental Health.